Hi folks, I'm Sohana and Wood.com where we get on Android every day. Anyway, I ordered some new t-shirts off We're High on Android. I have some new t-shirts because like, I got tired of wearing this like every day. I have like a stack of them. This is what I wear like every day or every other day. Anyway, I got new t-shirts coming. I'll be giving those out uh, probably end of this month because that's when they're coming in over at twitter.com slash Zetomax. Also, you'll be able to buy them on my store if you want to. Um, also, I have good news that I have a new site. I have a new site coming over at High on Android. It's called news highonandroid.com also how to site called uh, how to dot highonandroid.com all the new phones i'm gonna start making new sites because it's kind of confusing people people always ask me oh hey max how do you root htc1 and they don't know that my site exists htc1 root.com so i'm gonna try to put all my new sites into highonandroid.com it'll just be a new subdomain in the highonandroid.com that way it's easy for you guys to find uh, and yeah, it's easy for you guys to find. Anyway, um, today we'll be doing a quick ROM overview of a Lollipop a TouchWiz ROM, the Alliance ROM. I really like it. Uh, it's running on my SMN910F. Uh, I'm not sure if I can install it on T-Mobile. I haven't tested it, but tomorrow definitely I'm going to test it and let you know. Um, check back in my post if you want to see. Uh, but let's go ahead and uh, do a quick overview of this ROM. Let's go do this, baby. <sighs> All right, guys, here is my LED case. Don't forget to check this one out. It's a pretty cool case. It's like 50 bucks. Uh, if you ask me whether to get this one uh, or the S View case, I actually like this one better. But this one gets all kinds of grime on it um, if, you want, if you don't like cleaning your phone. And also, this one saves a lot more battery because it only uses those LEDs. Uh, also, I got this fly grip. It's really cool. I can make it just kind of like a stand anytime I want to. Uh, anyway, let's get onto the Brom overview here. And let's go over the Alliance ROM. Uh, we are in 4K now. You'll be able to see all the nitty gritty dust. I just feel like I might actually have to go back to 1080p because 4K just seems like too much resolution for me. Or I'm just not used to it. My eyes are just not used to it. Anyway, the Alliance ROM is awesome. It's got uh, Alliance Manager here and also Alliance ROM settings. Uh, this ROM comes with a bunch of different themes you can choose from like Tron Legacy, Decepticon, uh, Cap Cap America, America, uh, Android L, Alliance Gold. Ooh, that's actually one of my favorite themes. Uh, this is an Alliance theme. So that'll change out your keyboard, uh, some of the menu colors, the background, all that good stuff. Um, let's actually open up Chrome browser here. And there we go. So I've got a new keyboard there. But you can check out all the 12 different themes. Now, the coolest thing about this ROM isn't the themes. Uh, that you can make your own theme. Go to themes and colors. You can pretty much change every color on your phone. Uh, theme options here. And also link colors. There's like section for link colors and unlink colors. Um, so set those up. And then you can go here and set which one gets the link colors and some of them which one doesn't. Oh, sorry, here. And then you can ch change the colors here. Main color. Uh, pretty cool stuff. You can pretty much change all of this different colors here. There we go. Background colors. A ton of stuff. Now, that's not all. You can customize your phone just like an AOSP ROM. That's why I like Alliance ROM. Double tap to sleep. You can enable it just like an AOSP ROM. Alliance ROM has really brought a lot of the AOSP features. Uh, normally found on AOSP ROMs into TouchWiz and also this ROM is super fast and Lollipop stock is actually really solid for the international version the N910F um, but the Alliance ROM brings you that plus all these customizations uh, there is no overclocking yet but uh, I am going to be testing that this week so I should have an update that also on that also battery mod you can go ahead and change your battery uh, I'm getting this I gotta update it but I don't I don't want to update it right now. So I'm recording a video. A uh, status bar, notification panel. You can also change a bunch of stuff with notification. Your toggles, you can enable extra toggles. Heads up notifications. All right, what's really interesting? Uh, animations, you can go ahead and change your uh, list animations. Let me go ahead and just choose random ones here. And toast animation, I think this is for your whole animation. Uh, well, we will be able to see it soon. Uh, lock screen options. All right, let me show you some of my favorite one. My favorite one is the hardware key mapping. This is awesome. Double press. You can set it to all these different things. Screenshot, uh, lock screen. I set it to torch, which is really nice. So anytime I want to use my torch, I double click any, anywhere. 
and boom shakalaka. And you can set that for your camera. No, you can't, sorry. Oh yeah, you can't, custom app. You can set it to any app. Um, so that is really nice. You can also change the long press. Uh, I really like that. And also the back button, you can also do long press. Uh, kill apps, you know, that will kill apps. Um, if you ever stuck, if you ever get stuck on an app, you can go ahead and long press. And that is really cool. Hardware, key mapping, power menu, you can enable screenshot and screen recording. That means when you're using your Gear VR, uh, you can go ahead and use the screen recorder without using some, you know, a lot of those screen recorder apps, they don't work really well. They don't work well with the, uh, the Gear VR because the Gear VR is really intensive. But this one's native, so it should work really well. Also, there's call recording there. And that's about it as far as Alliance features. Of course, this ROM does come rooted, uh, Super SU there. And there may be some features I forgot to mention, but those are just the core features, uh, I would say, of the Alliance ROM. Of course, this ROM is super fast, uh, should give you plenty of good battery life. And that's about it. So check it out for this week's ROM of the Week, and do let me know if you have an SMN910F. If you have a T-Mobile, I should have a workaround, or you may have to wait for an actual Lollipop uh, bootloader. But also, when you install this, make sure you're on Lollipop bootloader. Uh, if you ever update it to the latest Lollipop, the German stock firmware, uh, then you're good to go. Otherwise, there is a way to actually install the bootloader only. Look, Go look on XDA. Uh, if you don't want to go look on XDA, if you feel lazy, just go ahead and download the whole German firmware and just install that also, you can do that. That's what I did, I got too lazy. Anyway, uh, that's about it. And thanks guys for watching this video. Don't forget to check out my new site. It's actually launching tomorrow and also the how-to site. We're gonna have all the best news and how-tos over at highonandrew.com. The main site is still the same. It's just gonna be me blabbing. Uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this show and don't forget to hit that like, subscribe guys. And uh, tomorrow is Monday and I hope you guys be safe. I know uh, traffic is crazy if you're driving to work. Um, just try to drive a little bit slower. Uh, you know, share the road with other people because, uh, you know, I used to be like that. I used to just go crazy road rage and just, you know, just kill people on the road. I'm the fastest. But, uh, yeah, share the road. Uh, have a great Monday if you can. And I'll see you guys soon. As always, uh, don't take life too seriously. And as always, stay on Android.